welcome to durga soft okay so in my regular sessions there are several people who are asking sir i don't know how to install python in my system sir in our sample programs you are telling that yes you are directly executing the small small coding snippets sir we don't know anything about python can you please tell how to install python in how many ways you can run python program like uh, there are several people who are asking in my regular uh, regular online sessions uh, sir that's why for them just uh, this is a separate sunday uh, a small one hour workshop how to install python how to set your environment uh, to execute your programs are you able to understand right that's on the main agenda sir i will show how to install python okay sir the main the main agenda of this one is how to install uh, okay python next after that okay in how many ways okay how many how many ways sir are there are there to execute a python program to execute a python python program like next and after that especially i want to use one normal text editor like edit plus how you can able to do with the edit plus like this one i am going to discuss right sir after some time maybe maybe in the future somewhere you may expect a python ide is also are you getting python ide is something like pycharm pycharm is there pycharm next and after that so pycharm is there eclipse is there Yeah, Eclipse is there. Next and after that, you know, Spider. Spider is also one beautiful idea, a beautiful idea for the Python server. Okay, these are the things sir, what I'm going to discuss. But main agenda of this session is only this part, sir. Okay. Anyway, sir, not ah, uh, uh, sir, this one, the this one, ah, uh, it is, it will be, it will be discussed somewhere in the next session. So don't worry about that. Okay. That's all, sir. Now let me talk, uh, sir, how to install Python. Do you know? these days everyone talks about python 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 <laughs> are you getting that more popular more popular sir okay more popular popular kind of thing is the python sir how you can you can able to install sir how you can use why the python is that much very uh, when compared with all remaining languages why the python is the more popular just you people will have a small look do you know the biggest advantage of python is do you know concise code are getting concise code so with very small code only you can able to do big big activities right suppose in other languages suppose 100 lines of the code is required 100 lines of code is required to do a particular activity right but in the python just only 10 to 15 lines only 10 to 15 lines only we can do the same activity sir remember that in the other languages sir if 100 lines of the code we require to write but in python 10 to 15 lines only so more more concise code are getting more concise code very less code very less code we can do big big activities right okay next the another another biggest advantage of python is rich libraries are getting another biggest advantage rich libraries sir if you want any activity if you want to perform anything sir for that library is available being a programmer just we require to use that's all we are not required we are not required to sir develop that library just we require to use that library that's all sir beyond that nothing remember that so the biggest advantage is rich library inside python batteries are there are you getting batteries batteries are there batteries are nothing but what libraries libraries are there you can do any activity very easily man ready made blocks are available just being a python programmer you require to use that all okay next uh, if you consider java or some other languages most of the times uh, without having class without having object you can't do anything are getting you can't do anything sir so compulsory if you consider java language sir first you have to declare class and then you have to create object and then you can call the required method but in python without the classes several things we are going to do with the classes several things we can able to do because python is object oriented programming language next the python is procedural programming language python is the scripting language python is modular programming language python is every type every any type of programming language is nothing but python python is all in one that's why 
so more flexible to use everything is very very easy sir next to the biggest another advantage of python here it is a freeware it is a open source we are not required to pay single paisa to any person to use python sir remember that okay there's a big python community is there happily we can able to get sir we are not required to pay single paisa also that is also biggest advantage why the people are more attracting right so three things sir concise code concise code easiness to the programmer next libraries are available next it's the freeware it is the open source remember that sir that's all this is now let me start the cinema how you can install python okay how to how to install python sir so it's a very simple sir in my system python is available or not let me cross check sir just if i type of python if I type a Python, normal folder is there. Are you getting that? It is, a, it is a related to my own documents. How many people are attending in which batch and so on. That may be available. Right? Sir, there is no Python software. One thing. Next, uh, if I open command prompt, if I open my command prompt, if I use Python, then automatically Python is not recognized as yeah, internal or external command. Are you getting There is no Python in my machine. Right? Sir, now what I have to do is Sir, it's a very, very easy. Now, what I have to do is, let me go for, let me, let me go for, okay, python.org. Observe that, python.org. Can you please uh, have a look once, uh, sir, what is the, what is the, what is the website name? Sir, have you observed? Python.org. It is the official website. It's the official website, uh, Python, Python. Sir, observe, Python Software Foundation. Remember who is the responsible to maintain this one, sir? Python Software Foundation. Python community people are responsible to maintain this one, sir. Python, uh, sir, dot org. Sir, next, uh, in the, in the, if you observe the about uh, downloads, documentation like, uh, sir, we have to worry about the uh, downloads. If, uh, if my cursor is moving downloads, uh, then automatically, do you know, sir, we have multiple, multiple versions are available, sir. By default, uh, Python, okay, download for Windows, sir, Python 3.6.5, Python 2.7.14. These are the, these are the updated recent versions of Python, sir. Python 3.6.5, Python 2.7.14, like this, right? Sir, here if you observe, it is you are talking about Windows or it's a, you are talking about Mac, even for other platforms also, Python is available. Remember that, sir, okay? Sir, other platforms means uh, which, which things they are going to provide support, sir. Okay. Python for IBM. Python for iOS. Python for Solaris. Python for VMS. Python for HP Unix. Sir, alternate, alternate Python packages for Linux. Like, uh, so even there are for multiple other, other platforms also, Python is available. But anyway, sir, we are using, sir, we are, we are going to use, uh, so Python uh, for Windows. Remember this one, sir. Sir, here, whenever you are talking about Python installation, one small thing I have to I have to explain, sir. Just uh, everyone can aware my regular students, but uh, sir, new members, can you please uh, observe that a bit carefully? In Python, we have two versions are there. Python 3.6.5. Next and after that, Python 3.6.5 is one one version. Sir, next, uh, what is the other version? Can you please uh, have you remember right? Python 2.0. 2.7.14, Python 2.7.14, correct, okay? Sir, these are the two versions, right? Because in Python, there are two parallel versions of there, sir. Remember this one. So, which is uh, Python 2, next and after that Python 3, sir. So, there are two parallel versions are available in the Python. Python 2 and the Python 3. Sir, most of the people are going to feel Python 3 is the advanced version of python 2 python 3 will provide support for python 2 like no sir python free language developed yes independent language remember that sir. python 3 language developed yes independent language okay python 3 and python 2 are not compatible remember that sir if the program which is running on python 2 sir compulsory is going to run on python 3 no such type of guarantee at all because it is a developed as yes, independent language. Remember this one, sir. So Python 2 and Python 3, sir, something like you can feel these are different, even same language, different versions, sir, but 
still consider the different programming languages uh, like that right okay it is not the uh, enhanced version of python 2 it is completely from the scratch independent language okay guido developed sir remember that that's why so there is no compatibility between python 2 and the python 3 then immediately you ask sir which version which version of python we require to go for highly recommended we should go for python 3 because the power of python 3 because of uh, the power of python is coming because of python 3 only next up from 2020 now it is the 2018 now it is the 2018 next uh, from 2020 onward there is no support for python 2 remember this one sir by 2020 yes sir, this python 2 cinema is going to be end that's why compulsory python 3 we require to practice we require to install clear for lap right okay that's all because uh, if if it is going to support is not there in the 20 from 2020 why they are maintaining because still still the existing projects may be a chance of some enhanced features may be a chance of some bugs so for that uh, for that uh, this uh, this concept came in the picture Vedan, are you able to understand <clears throat> if we write in python 2 python 2 enhancements won't be there python 2 if any bug is coming no one is there to provide support man okay that's all that's why from 2020 onwards no support for python 2 that's why happily you can go for what python 3 so if you want to install which version is recommended sir python 3 that's all right okay so now here what i have to do in the python 3 just observe downloads python 3.6.5 remember this one sir huh yes python uh, no support but python 2 will continue right yes python 2 will continue right if you have software you can able to use but the, it doesn't mean python 2 is going to end okay if the support is not there who is going to use <laughs> are you getting parts are they your doubt is too good yeah if the support is not there then no one is going to use man because the reason is somewhere suddenly some problem came who is going to who is going to provide support for that nothing that's why even even if you are using licensed version of windows also now you can make a phone call to windows people saying i'm uh, microsoft people saying are i'm using my uh, windows uh, microsoft xp windows xp version windows xp version can you please provide support then automatically officially microsoft people are telling no support for windows xp remember that okay don't ask anything about windows xp even you are using also sorry from our side we want to do anything if you want you can use windows 7 or 8 or 10 like they are going to tell clear right okay next time after that do you know here if you if you observe the if you observe the okay in the downloads windows can you please uh, have a have a look once sir now uh, here at the bottom you can able to see something note that python 3.5 cannot be used on windows xp or earlier windows xp or earlier why man why python 3 cannot provide support for windows xp or earlier what is the reason for that because microsoft people are telling no enhancements for windows xp that's why so it is outdated for outdated versions uh, we are not going to provide support like uh, make sure sir so anyway let me start the uh, python 3. Point, uh, okay just click this one that's all just click this then automatically the corresponding software by default is going to be downloaded matter of just uh, uh, it's a it's a very uh, very less 2.95 only show in folder okay like uh, so now this is the python 3.6.5 observe that this is python python 3.6.5 okay like i have this is the software installable software what we have sir just uh, let me copy paste okay observe that this is this is the this is the python software nothing sir what we require to do sir take a bit very special care with the installation download is a very easy man okay like uh, just uh, double click this one <coughs> double click this run run double click this one run uh -huh. here take very very special care do you know uh, the people who are working on java the people who are working on java how many people are there from java side can you please confirm sir i am coming from java background anyone there anyone there from java yes okay there are multiple multiple people are there sir after java installation compulsory what we require to do sir once we install java in our system we require to set a path correct or not okay we require to set path path jdk bin directory up to that we require to set the path okay like 
so but in python we require to the path but we are not required to do manually what we have to do here <laughs> here there is the option is there at the time of installation only yes environment variable path by default is going to set but here we are not required to do anything sir this is whether it is a 32 bit or 60 64 bit no problem at all we are not required to worry it's going to provide support man okay yes in my system is the 64 bit only but it's going to provide support for 32 bits okay it is uh, so big wise don't worry about that it's happily it's going to provide support okay now take a bit very very special case are here so pc can you please install now it is telling next turn after that here one thing is there yard the three point yard the python 3.62 path oh we are not required to set the path in java okay like uh, uh, we are not required to set path in java just like java here just uh, check this one okay it's a very important sir check this one then automatically python will be added to our environment variables remember that next time after that can you please observe that install now install now it includes uh, ideal ideal ideally python ideally pip and the documentation create shortcuts and the file associations right okay like everything yes let me click this one let me click this one yes yes uh, madan no problem at all it's going to be supported okay here there is no 32 bit or 64 bit version don't worry sir sir happily you can uh, you can able to use sir install now yes customized installation means uh, sanket customized installation means i don't want all facilities i want only basic or something like uh, you can able to specify like that yes for the purpose of pip all those things will be covered in our regular sessions so don't worry sumit <clears throat> yes it is ready Yeah, Milandas, it will be uploaded in the YouTube after this session. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. I will discuss Vedanta Vari. Just remind once what is the what is the need of path. Okay. Meanwhile, just observe that some people are expecting what is the path and so on, right? What is the why why we require to use the path, the environment variable, and so on. Very, very simple, sir. If I open command prompt. If I open command prompt, we are going to use from the command prompt. Okay, there are several things. Okay, there are there are several several things we are we are going to do. Sir, I'm using Java C command. Next time after that, I'm using Java command. I'm using Python command. Like uh, you are going to use several commands, right? Whenever we are using command, whenever we are using command, any command, sir, it may be Python or it may be Java or it may be Java C. Immediately, my Windows operating system has to execute the corresponding exe file are you getting if i can use java c then automatically it's going to execute java c dot exe file sir from where from where it is going to select this java c dot exe similarly if i use python then automatically it's going to use python dot exe file from where my system can able to identify the corresponding exe file okay immediately my system will search in the path environment variable right okay there is one environment variable is there in the path in the path environment variable in all locations location one location two location three like in all locations it is going to search for this exe file if anywhere exe file is there then automatically it's going to execute that exe file remember so to make python commands to work uh, python or java commands uh, we require to set the path compulsory okay in the python installation will yard that automatically but in other languages we require in other languages we require to set explicitly after installation clear yes vedanta are you able to understand what is the purpose of path okay if you are not setting the path what will happen sir 
commands from the command prompt they won't execute my system unable to recognize corresponding commands that's why after completing your installation compulsory we have to set the path but here we are not required to set the path the reason is automatically the part of installation only it is doing that activity right yes that's all sir here can you set up successful set up successful special thanks to mark uh hamand uh, without whose uh, sir without whose years of freely shared windows expertise python for windows would still okay would, would still be python for dos only like uh, so this person this person providing uh, this person okay helper like anything okay to develop windows version of python sir remember that okay so that's all anyway close that's it sir now in my system python is already ready ready sir how you can able to tell python is ready sir very very simple very simple sir just start 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 program next and after that python just if you can type sir can you please observe earlier earlier whenever i i used python earlier i got one folder and my files that's all but now programs are you getting right programs by the part i'm going to get the ideally python 36 bit python 3 3.6 32 bit version like uh, we have these are just a document <laughs> documents right don't worry about that sir this is python ideal this this is the python 3.6 and so on like so python is there in my system okay that's all sir now once python is there sir am i required to set path am i required to set uh, anything sir not required man. one minute let me cross check in my system in my in my system what is the path the path variable is it already set or not because I, I, it's, a, it's all automatically set sir what there inside path okay path what what there inside inside path variable sir let me cross check let me cross check here this is my path variable are you seeing anything related to the python yes man are you seeing anything related to the python yes if you observe the c colon user to lenovo app data local programs and so on scripts this is the first thing added next and after that this one is the second thing added like so for python 32 something added added sir in my environment variable right okay because multiple times i install that's why multiple times it is added remember that next this is what is this one sir <laughs> have you observed what it is one c colon program by java jdk bin okay it is the uh, it is java related path who added this one who added this path explicitly by myself only are you getting right explicitly by programmer in java we record yet explicitly but in python these things will be added automatically to the path variable that's all sir now sir python is ready in my system clear right up to this what we did sir we open python.org next and after that we open we open python.org next are downloads downloads windows just a python 3.6.5 now automatically i got the installation i got installation python installation software sir yeah, yeah. then just double click that run automatically automatically python will be installed but while executing this one compulsory you have to select path it is highly recommended <coughs> that's all okay now my next point take a bit very very special care about this one sir it is ready sir in how many ways you can execute you can execute sir python code remember that sir so sometimes just for familiarity purpose just to familiar with python syntax syntax purposes what we can able to do python provide python provide one repl tool sir what is this one sir python provide one repl tool okay what is the meaning of repl sir read evaluate print and loop again read evaluate print again again like this right this is nothing but what the sir python python repl repl means read read e means evolve evolve evaluate evolve like next and after the print print and then loop again so if i can provide any statement any statement in the in the in the sir console or otherwise in the ideal tool then first it will read that and it will execute evaluate evaluate and print the result and then again repeat the same process again 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 and so on right okay 
again 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 and so on okay sir make make sure read evaluate print and loop again again like uh, it is going to do that everyone can able to understand right this thing is by default considered a python repl tool which is nothing but python ide sir in java 9 j shell are getting in java 9 j shell came but here in the python from day one onwards only it came in the picture sir Sir, first what i will do are i want to i want to print uh, small small things right only one or two lines i want to do that suppose print uh, hello world i want to do that matter of only one line matter of only one line or otherwise what is the value of 10 plus 20 can you please tell what is the output sir 10 uh, less than 20 something like uh, i want to execute just the only one or two lines uh, there we are not required to go for separate editor we are not required to write separate program like uh, open open this python ideal python ideal tool directly you can able to you can able to execute these lines you can able to see the output sir sir can you please uh, remember this what is this one python repl repl tool what is that repl sir read evaluate print and loop one minute i will look one sir how you can able to open <clears throat> okay like uh, how you can able to open just the python okay like sir can you please observe what is the first first if you if you are seeing python ide python ideal tool are you getting python ideal tool sir sir very very simple if i if i can uh, python ideal what i am doing it is required multiple times just uh, drag to my window here just uh, because it is required multiple times just uh, i open this one just i open most of the times you know our core level programs is going to be uh, done with this with this only sir python uh, python console by default came in the picture remember that sir now do you know if you if you observe that sir python 3.6.5 shell python shell okay like now what i want to take you can write any python code sir first i'm writing print off print off welcome to python welcome to python python okay like i'm i'm taking sir if i can take so i'm just typing now first uh, this python shell will read will read the read this line okay evaluate this line read evaluate and and the print print the corresponding output after evaluation whatever result is there can you please print that can you please print print that like this right now have you look once yes so welcome to python again again it is ready for the to read next line next line sir print of sir uh, durga soft something like i'm taking sir sir do you know durga soft something like i'm i'm taking sir observe the a bit very very carefully about this terminology right so it is going to read evaluate print read evaluate print again repeat the same thing loop means what repeat the same thing which is nothing but sir repel tool in java in python in in ios like uh, there are multiple places that these type of tools are very common sir the biggest advantage of these tools is without writing big big code uh, just uh, we can familiar with the python syntaxes clear yes man are you getting what is this one so the first way how you can able to run python code from the python shell how you can able to start the shell what is the symbol for that is the very very clear for you people right okay sir i hope this one python shell in in your start uh, start window if you can type python if you can type python then automatically do you know the first first thing sir python shell is going to come just click that just click that automatically it is going to open this clear for all of the right that's all so suppose if i can take 10 plus 20 what the answer sir 30 if i can take 10 less than 20 what the answer sir true by default uh, we are going to get sir sir then yes uh srivani is asking sir then where is the concept of loop here have you observed srivani have a look once sir I'm writing some line. I'm writing some line. What is the first activity it is going to do, sir? First read. First read. Read. My Python shell is going to read this line. Python shell is going to evaluate. Python shell is going to evaluate. And the Python shell is going to print. So RGP. Already you are saying. RGP. You are saying. Where is the L? L means uh, loop. Loop means uh, again repeat. Again repeat. So again, again, read. 
again read evaluate and then print after that again read evaluate print that okay print that again read evaluate print that sir i have to read evaluate print the how many times it's going to be happen not one time multiple times again 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 which is nothing but loop <laughs> are you able to understand srivani okay that's all so this is about the what is the what is the what is the meaning of sir how you can able to execute python code from the from the python shell clear for all of you right sir from the shell what kind of code we are going to execute sir any small coding snippets we are going to execute to test the functionality remember that sir okay beyond that nothing this this is sir now my requirement is okay sir first one same way if you if you don't want sir i don't want to i don't want to uh, i don't want to use this one sir because sometimes what will happen is okay it is a python shell much support you may not expect here sometimes what will happen the same thing you can able to do from the command prompt also okay let me open sir command prompt okay let me open command prompt you can go to any location no problem at all sir so you can you can go to any any location by default you can you can go for that now just uh, if you want to enter into python shell are you getting if you want to enter into python shell what we have to do is sir just uh, type uh, ah uh, type uh, can you please tell what i have to type please respond what i have to type sir from the command prompt i want to enter into python shell what is the what is the what is the thing i have to type okay python okay remember that so we have we can type sir from the command prompt from the command prompt okay from the command prompt you can type uh, either py or python no problem at all either py or python no problem at all automatically python shell by default is going to start sir okay like either py either py or python anything you can use now let me take python okay like now my python shell started are you getting in the python here whatever whatever you have whatever you have the same thing by default python shell started from here are you getting now it is it is a more comfortable because most of the times we are familiar with the uh, you know sir uh, command prompt usage most of the times that's why better to open the biggest advantage here is also navigation and so on such a type of support you can able to see from our command prompt regular but here you know sir after complaint here there is no much much support you can't see okay that's why highly highly recommended better to go like this now here you can do all the things hello sir print off hello whatever you did from the python shell here also same thing you can able to do sir 10 plus 20 30 by default you are going to get like 10 less than sir all the things by default you can able to see sir so which command a user python is the command sir sir i want to exit this python shell i want a normal command prompt sir if i want to exit from the shell if i want the normal command prompt exit remember this one exit function we require to call what is the function name can you please spell out what is the function name we require to call exit exit is the function name that's all now normal command prompt it is going to come in the picture are you getting right so can i use py to enter to enter again can i use py respond can i use py yes again again python shell is going to start if you want to practice any kind of thing happily you can able to do that sir that's all clear up to this any doubt okay that's it sir this is about just anyway python python shells either from the command prompt or from the python shell sir python ideal tool what you require to do is just a small small coding snippets only you are going to execute usually sir bigger code not at all recommended to execute sir sir i want i have a program of 20 lines 30 lines and so on never recommended to type here just only one or two lines sir you can able to check no problem at all sir okay that's all uh, under python one minute from the command vishnu python what is the what is the difference between python shell and the python from the command prompt both the things are same are you getting both both the things are same uh, vishnu both the things are same there is no difference at all here from the python shell what you are 
doing from the command prompt uh, python shell also you can do the same thing only but now instead of entering from here now i'm trying to enter the same software from the command prompt beyond that nothing sir okay getting <clears throat> Python ideal, ideal is the is the word that they kept the name. Okay, beyond that nothing. I D L E. Yes. Here there is a one more facility is there, sir. One more facility is there with the Python I D L E. Okay, are you getting that? Integrated development uh, environment, something. There is some some more flexibilities are there. If you have a look once here, just uh, what are various options are available at the top. Can you please have a look? Sir, it is not the, it is not the just the only, it is not the just the only, only, uh, do you know something like uh, uh, just uh, what, what you can use uh, only one line type and then execute now. It can able to do several extra things, right? Have you observed? File is there, edit is there, shell is there, debug is there, options are there, window is there, help is there and so on. Sir, now my requirement is sir i want uh, i want my requirement is okay i i want i want to enter just uh, i want to write a big program are getting a program i want to execute sir so if you want to write a program not recommended not recommended okay to use just uh, sir shell or otherwise command from what we have to do save our code inside a file and then execute that file. Are you getting? Save our code inside a file and then execute that, sir. Okay. Now my requirement is, suppose read some number. Read some number from the command prompt. Read some number from the command prompt. Print those many times. Hello. Huh? Welcome to Python. Like that about my requirement, sir. Are you getting? So read some some int value some int value from the from the keyboard are you getting can you please dynamic dynamic input sir dynamic input can you please read read like that and then what we require to do is print uh, those many number of times those many those many number number of times uh, uh, number of times uh, uh, so just uh, some message some message i want to print this is about my requirement right what we have to do there are multiple ways are there to do that okay one way is uh, you can use uh, python ideal okay python ideal from that you can able to do that sir how you can do that very simple can you please observe what is the first option we have at the top hey please read what is the first option we have ah respond man what is the first one first one we have yes file are you getting first one is file okay like file new file are you getting file new file control n okay well are you getting my python okay python your file file is going to come here you can write any sequence big lines of the python code sir okay now i'm taking n is equal to n is equal to int of int of input of enter enter some number enter some number like this i'm asking assume that sir enter enter some number like that. now for i in range of n for i in range of n n like this i'm taking yeah can you please print print hello hello getting getting errors is very common getting errors is very common open google open google uh, open google to sir get or to resolve okay sir make sure suppose some people are using some python okay may not windows version or linux version or ibm some uh, they are using some other versions no problem at all sir if you are if you are seeing some problem immediately open the google so and so problem i'm facing okay so and so problem i'm facing just type the somewhere definitely the people are going to provide solutions for that okay remember that suppose exit command in my os is not working okay then they are going to provide solution for that don't worry about that uh, just the one or two members yes ibmi also file yes gopi 
just uh, have just uh, write python installation on ibmi then automatically you will get much support from the google nothing is there sir it, it is the most popular language definitely it is going to be installed on anywhere sir the problem what you people are facing already lakhs of people already faced this problem lakhs of times remember this one sir okay that's why sir compulsor in the google for any kind of thing solution is there open just a type your problem n number of experts are going to provide n number of solutions sir best way of learning remember that okay sir now just i'm trying to do that okay well now what i have to do is sir it is a small code python code i want to save this code as a file remember this one sir sir usually if you want to save python programs as a file as a file what we have to do is we have to save any name you can use but compulsory extension can you please tell what extension we require to use right py remember this one sir if we are writing java program if we are writing java program then automatically we are going to type as test.java correct right test.java but if you are writing python program then automatically we require to yeah, save yeah dot py extension you can keep any name no problem at all sir from the python ide file window also you can save this code very simple control yes control yes yes just to save control yes okay where you want to save from in which location okay my own location d colon durga classes okay d colon durga classes now i'm taking demo dot py are you getting up your right what is the name of user sir demo dot py save sir okay once i save it once i save it at the top you can able to see yes this is the demo dot py in which location it is there sir like complete information at the top okay well i wrote some program sir of course by using python ideal only i wrote some program sir now i require to execute this program observe a bit very carefully sir i require to execute this program sir file edit format run run can you please observe the run module run module sir which which command we require to use short command is there f5 okay f5 or otherwise you can click this one sir i'm clicking this or f5 command you can use then automatically yes here python shell is going to open it is asking enter some number are getting enter some number okay number five i'm taking sir then automatically hello getting errors is very common open google to resolve are you getting right how many times it is printed sir array how many times it is printed five times because i enter what is the number five let me open again this one again this one what i have to do sir f of five this time i don't want to use shortcut directly sir from the keyboard i'm trying uh, from the from the keyboard i'm trying to keep f5 from the keyboard i'm trying to keep f5 enter some number again enter some number what i'm taking this time three i'm taking sir then automatically three times by default we are going to get everyone can able to understand right so if you can provide the string and so on you may get error you may get error sir because the reason because the reason for that is here i'm trying to typecast to int i'm trying to typecast to int that's why so you may get some you will definitely will get some error but that thing we are going to take care in our regular sessions so just observe how to install python in how many ways we can run everyone can able to understand ayo <coughs> yes uh srivani yes once you open once you open once you open this one then automatically do you know so you can save or if you don't want without saving also you can run no problem at all srivani here just observe demo dot py completed now i'm taking sir new file new file i'm trying to open another file sir okay one minute one minute because multiple are there this one i'm trying to close this window sir this one i'm trying to close this no problem i open new one here what i'm taking for uh, sir any any code you can able to do sir any code uh, any code you can able to do for i in range for i in range of 5 i'm taking for i in range of 5 okay or otherwise okay here just i'm taking x is equal to x is equal to int a input of enter first number i'm trying to enter sir enter first number next uh, int y is equal to y is equal to int a 
ಇನ್ಪುಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಂಟರ್ ಎಂಟರ್ ಇನ್ಪುಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಂಟರ್ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ಆಮ್ ಟೇಕಿಂಗ್ ಸರ್ ಎಂಟರ್ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಓಕೆ ಲೈಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಮೈ ರಿಕ್ವೈರ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ರೈಟ್ ಸೊ ಕೆನ್ ಯು ಪ್ಲೀಸ್ ಪ್ರೊವೈಡ್ ರೀಡ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ನಂಬರ್ ರೀಡ್ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ನಂಬರ್ ರೈಟ್ ನೌ ಆಮ್ ಟೇಕಿಂಗ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಅ ಪ್ರಿಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಪ್ರಿಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಸಮ್ ಆರ್ ಅದರ್ವೈಸ್ ಪ್ರಿಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ವೈ ರಿಗಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಸಿಮಿಲರ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರಿಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಮೈನಸ್ ವೈ ಪ್ರಿಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವ್ ದ ಪ್ರಿಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಮೈನಸ್ ವೈ ಪ್ರಿಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಇಂಟು ವೈ ಲೈಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ಆಮ್ ಟೇಕಿಂಗ್ ಸರ್ ಸರ್ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವ್ ದಟ್ ದಟ್ಸ್ ಆಲ್ ದಿಸ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಅ ಸಮ್ ಮ್ಯಾಥಮೆಟಿಕಲ್ ಆಪರೇಷನ್ಸ್ ಆಮ್ ಡೂಯಿಂಗ್ ಸರ್ ಓಕೆ ನೌ ವಾಟ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಟೇಕ್ ವಾಟ್ ವಿ ರಿಕ್ವೈರ್ ಟು ಟೇಕ್ ಸರ್ ಇನ್ ದ ನಾರ್ಮಲ್ ನೋಟ್ ಪ್ಯಾಡ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ನಾಟ್ ಗೋನ್ ಟು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ರನ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಶ್ರೀವಾಣಿ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಫೈಲ್ ಈಸ್ ಓಪನ್ ಫ್ರಾಮ್ ಪೈಥಾನ್ ಶೆಲ್ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವೈ ಇಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ರನ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಡೋಂಟ್ ಯೂಸ್ ನೋಟ್ ಪ್ಯಾಡ್ ಇನ್ ದ ನೋಟ್ ಪ್ಯಾಡ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಗೋನ್ ಟು ಟೈ ಇಟ್ ವೋಂಟ್ ರನ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ವೋಂಟ್ ಕಮ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಪಿಕ್ಚರ್ ಓಕೆ ಲೈಕ್ ನೌ ವಾಟ್ ಮೈ ರಿಕ್ವೈರ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಇಯರ್ ಐ ಡೋಂಟ್ ವಾಂಟ್ ಸೇವ್ ವಿತೌಟ್ ಸೇವಿಂಗ್ ಈಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಗೋನ್ ಟು ರನ್ ಆರ್ ನಾಟ್ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವ್ ದಟ್ ಎಫ್ ಫೈವ್ ಎಫ್ ಫೈವ್ ಆಮ್ ಯೂಸಿಂಗ್ ಸರ್ ಎಫ್ ಫೈವ್ ಸರ್ ಸೋರ್ಸ್ ಮಸ್ಟ್ ಬಿ ಸೇವ್ಡ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಯು ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವ್ ರೈಟ್ ಸೋರ್ಸ್ ಮಸ್ಟ್ ಬಿ ಸೇವ್ಡ್ ಓಕೆ ಹಾ ಓಕೆ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವ್ ದಟ್ ಓಕೆ ಲೈಕ್ ಸರ್ ನೌ ಆಮ್ ಟ್ರೈಂಗ್ ಟು ಟೇಕ್ ಡೆಮೋ ಡೆಮೋ ಒನ್ ಡಾಟ್ ಪಿ ವೈ ಸೊ ಸೋರ್ಸ್ ಮಸ್ಟ್ ಬಿ ಸೇವ್ಡ್ ಡು ಯು ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಸೇವ್ ಎಸ್ ಡೆಮೋ ಒನ್ ಸರ್ ಇಮಿಡಿಯೇಟ್ಲಿ ಎಂಟರ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಸರ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಎಂಟರ್ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಟೆನ್ ಅವ್ ಯು ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವ್ ರೈಟ್ ಹಾ ಟೆನ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಟೆನ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಮೈನಸ್ ಟೆನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಇಂಟು ಟೆನ್ ದ ಕರೆಸ್ಪಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಔಟ್ಪುಟ್ ಬೈ ದಿಫಾಲ್ಟ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಗೆಟ್ ದಟ್ಸ್ ಆಲ್ ದಿಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಒನ್ ವೇ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ರೈಟ್ ಬಿಗ್ ಬಿಗ್ ಕೋಡ್ ರೈಟ್ ಓಕೆ ಲೈಕ್ ಈವನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಎವರ್ ಲೆಂತ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಕೋಡ್ ವಾಟ್ ಎವರ್ ಲೆಂತ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಕೋಡ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಟೇಕ್ ಸರ್ ಸರ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿಲಿ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ರೈಟ್ ಸರ್ ಬಿಗ್ ಬಿಗ್ ಕೋಡ್ ನೋ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ಎಟ್ ಆಲ್ ಸರ್ ಈವನ್ ಹಂಡ್ರೆಡ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಲೈನ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಕೋಡ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಏಬಲ್ ಟು ಡೂ ದಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಒನ್ ವೇ ರಿಮೆಂಬರ್ ದಟ್ ಕ್ಲಿಯರ್ ಆರ್ ಯು ಎಬಲ್ ಟು ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ರೈಟ್ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಸರ್ ಯು ಸೇವ್ಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕೋಡ್ ಸಮ್ವೇರ್ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆದ ಯು ಸೇವ್ಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕೋಡ್ ಸಮ್ವೇರ್ ಸಮ್ವೇರ್ ಓಕೆ ಲೈಕ್ ಸರ್ ನೌ ಹೌ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ರನ್ ದಟ್ ಕೋಡ್ ಓಕೆ ವೇರ್ ಐ ಸೇವ್ಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕೋಡ್ ಸರ್ ಡೆಮೋ ಒನ್ ಡಾಟ್ ಡೆಮೋ ಡೆಮೋ ಡಾಟ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಆರ್ ಡೆಮೋ ಒನ್ ಡಾಟ್ ವೇರ್ ಐ ಸೇವ್ಡ್ ಸರ್ ಡಿ ಕೋಲ ದುರ್ಗಾ ಕ್ಲಾಸಸ್ ಡಿ ಕೋಲ ದುರ್ಗಾ ಕ್ಲಾಸಸ್ ರೈಟ್ ಸರ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ರನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಈವನ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದ ಕಮ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಪ್ರಾಮ್ಟ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ನೋ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ಎಟ್ ಆಲ್ ಓಕೆ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ವೇ ಸರ್ ಲೆಟ್ ಮೀ ಗೋ ಟು ದಟ್ ಲೊಕೇಶನ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಕ್ಟ್ ಓಕೆ ನವ್ ಆಮ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಕಮ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಪ್ರಾಮ್ ಇನ್ ವಿಚ್ ಲೊಕೇಶನ್ ಎಸ್ ಮ್ಯಾನ್ ಇನ್ ವಿಚ್ ಲೊಕೇಶನ್ ಆಮ್ ದೇರ್ ಡಿ ಕೋಲ್ ಆನ್ ದುರ್ಗಾ ಕ್ಲಾಸಸ್ ನೌ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಪಿ ವೈ ಸರ್ ವಿಚ್ ಕಮ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಆಮ್ ಗೋನ್ ಟು ಯೋರ್ ಪಿ ವೈ ಆ ಡೆಮೋ ಒನ್ ಡಾಟ್ ಪಿ ವೈ ಸೊ ಏತರ್ ಪಿ ವೈ ಡೆಮೋ ಒನ್ ಡಾಟ್ ಪಿ ವೈ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಯೂಸ್ ಆರ್ ಪೈತಾನ್ ಪೈತಾನ್ ಸರ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಸರ್ ಏತರ್ ಫುಲ್ ವರ್ಡ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಯೂಸ್ ಆರ್ ಪಿ ವೈ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಒನ್ ವರ್ಡ್ ಬೈ ದಿ ಫಾರ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಏಬಲ್ ಟು ಯೂಸ್ ನೋ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ಸರ್ ಸೊ
okay are getting notepad because in every system compulsory it should be there notepad i'm taking sir x is equal to int of input of okay input a enter first number okay enter enter some number like this i'm taking sir enter enter some number okay like like i'm taking sir this is sir now if here just to take a bit very special can okay? i don't want to do much much activity right so here for i in range of x for i in range of x can you please print can you please print hello 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 na like this i'm taking sir sir just uh, have you observed where i'm where i'm writing this code sir in the normal notepad normal notepad let me save this code let me save this code decode on durga classes so sample any name you can use that py sample dot py okay this is but uh, never recommend to use the notepad for your python programs in the python indentation matters a lot then automatically you know you may get the problem next uh, syntax highlighters are not there all the things in black and white only that's why this approach is not recommended let me execute this code sir py what is the name i used ayo i forgot what is the name i used re sample dot py are getting py enter some number enter some number sir some seven i'm taking then automatically seven times sir. hello 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 like by default it's going to print okay from sir normal notepad from normal notepad you can write code but save with the dot the py extension that it must be required okay but uh, this notepad not recommended because here no syntax highlighter okay not that much readable not that much meaningful debugging all the things will become difficult to write that's all so what i will do is in my regular classes i'm always using one 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 editor okay edit plus are you getting that i'm always going to use which editor sir edit plus edit plus writer i'm using always uh, I'm, I'm always going to use edit plus writer uh, one minute uh, yes sir what should be the location of this file sample.py yes from which location i'm trying to execute sir d colon durga classes so better to save in that location yes we are at very beginning in the current working directory we have to save okay like now here just uh, there is uh, another another approach is there sir what we have to do sir better highly recommended of course in my java sessions also i'm always going to use this one so if you want small small chota programs only up to core python or up to advanced python if you want to do this uh, this editor is the best right what you require to do is currently in my system which version of edit plus is there sir already edit plus is already there sir <coughs> Mm. what happen if i have some syntax errors and saved in notepad and uh, try to run program yes gopi so automatically syntax errors are going to come then you have to fix that one minute have a look once this is my program this is my program i didn't close this one i didn't close i open i open parenthesis i didn't close let me execute this code immediately let me py sample dot py immediately python will give left and right hey where is uh, sir observe the syntax error where it is expecting syntax error where syntax error invalid syntax are you getting let me open once again this under let me close that let me save control yes i'm pressing here control yes now observe that it is going to work in the picture clear right gopi okay that's all now here highly recommended better to download okay this better to better to download edit plus right so it's a it's a very easy because by using this editor edit plus editor you can write uh, multiple programs right i mean multiple language programs you can able to write okay how you can do that okay here very simple help help about edit plus currently in my mission which which edit plus we have what is the version sir anyone can you please tell what the version we have edit plus 4.3 are you getting edit plus 4.3 version is there currently edit plus 5 is also coming but recommended 4.3 old version right how you can able to do that very simple sir open the google ah uh, open the google sir okay uh <laughs> vikas singh is asking it's is the is it free or not is it free or not okay i can able to tell i can i can able to tell yes 30 days evaluation period is there 
30 days evaluation period is there sir after 30 days evaluation period you required to sir enter the key but how you can get the key multiple ways are there <laughs> open the google open the google uh, open the google so is there any key for that you can able to search if some god is there for us well and good okay <laughs> remember my words now have a look once sir sir it is sir in the google edit plus download edit plus download okay edit plus download like this sir that's all so direct edit plus download free trial here okay like free trial here like sir now here just observe that this is edit plus ftp text editor for windows like do you know sir edit plus 5.0 evaluation version is there sir remember this one edit plus 5.0 evaluation version is there so upgrade for registered user previous version let me take previous version yes okay so download edit plus version 4 for 64 bit latest patch and so on sir let me click download edit plus version 4 okay now it's going to be downloaded sir this is just observe that download edit plus version 4 so in my system already it is there <clears throat> yes completed let me show in the folder okay that's all this is about let me copy yes let me copy paste here yes this is the software sir nothing what you have to do it's a very easy to install sir very easy to install run run because already in my mission edit plus is already open right one minute matter of one minute let me let me close this current edit plus window and then i will let me close okay that's all now edit plus is not in open state just because it will be upgraded beyond that nothing sir that's all okay we want they want a low program to make changes for your computer c colon program files edit plus start copy yes congratulations setup completed successfully that's all so automatically one desktop icon also will come in the picture let me open the sir edit plus license version yes like okay okay like you can the setup override existing yes no problem at all yes sir, that's all okay it may ask uh, sir 30 days evaluation period after that you require to enter the key and so on okay that thing you can able to take care don't worry about that it is uh, not that much dangerous if you open file observe that if you open file file okay here sir new new file new then automatically sir normal text html page browser window configure c c plus plus parallel java other like this it is there sir okay yes now have a look once akash uh, why edit plus except notepad yes that's what you can able to see sir these are various file types supported by sir this edit plus are you getting text normal text html crc plus plus parallel php java jsp javascript vb script and so on our python ruby e ruby markdown these things are going to be supported now i'm taking uh, sorry python now i'm taking python that's all python now you may ask sir why already notepad is there why edit plus if you are game i hope you remember how i type this code let me type uh, same thing here let me type x is equal to int of int of input of int of input of enter enter some number enter some number so now for i in range of sir x for i in range of x print a observe 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 some difference observe some difference yes man are you able to see some difference when compared with the notepad when compared with the notepad normal notepad and this one automatic indentation by default will be there are you getting so here no indentation after this it will go to the first the next indentation like i require to type okay but here if you observe after this enter indentation by default will be there next uh, keywords in the sir blue color 
next time after that functions in the sir gray color something like comments in the rose color pink color like by default it's going to come so more readable more readable more easy easy to write the code remember that sir yes so who asked this question akash are you able to see some difference akash yes okay that's it so this is what you have let me save this code again control yes sir again control yes sir here it will ask so you can browse your location d colon durga classes d colon durga classes okay here you can take demo 7 demo 7 dot py okay like it is saved in the d colon it is saved in the d colon d colon okay durga classes let me go to that location py demo 7 dot py Enter some number, seven I'm taking, then automatically observe some difference, observe some difference, like we are going to get. Everyone can able to understand, right? Sir, that's all. Initialization of edit plus, initialization of sir, Python program. It's very easy, man. Just write some code, save with some name in our current working directory, in the location, then from the command from go to that location, then happily you can able to run that. Okay, one thing. Next, uh, there are even in the edit plus multiple options are available, sir. Those things we are not required to worry. Okay. So edit plus only control one, control two, like we can configure tools, sir. If you can use control one, there only the program is going to run. Okay. But more clarity for learning purpose, better to use a different thing. One thing. Next, uh, some people are asking notepad plus plus. Highly recommended, Ankita. You can use Notepad plus plus also. What Edit plus is doing, Notepad plus plus also will do the same thing. Are you getting both are editors only? Ankita, are you getting? <clears throat> yes. Up to this, any doubt? Sir, up to this, any doubt? Are you in a position to understand? Every day, I'm trying to execute the program. Then automatically the people are asking, sir, how you can install, how you can run and so on. Now I hope environment wise clear. But after installation in the edit plus, a small thing you have to do, man. Yes, yes. Uh, yes, sir, I will come up to that point also. A small thing you have to you have to do, sir. What you require to do, sir, here, after installing your, your edit plus, there is one thing you require to do that. Okay, what the, sir, window, window no here tools tools is there preferences is there just observe the tools preferences next uh, files files like uh, here there is one thing is there okay uh, what what we call uh, by default create backup file while saving this one is going to by default is going to check create backup create backup file uh, while saving like every time whenever you save it is always going to create backup copy sir demo 7.py.bak dot by bak and so on it's always irritation like anything so what you can able to do is sir file here tools preferences tool preferences and then file sir create backup file while saving that's all you require to just uncheck that uncheck that by default it will be there uncheck that okay that's all that is a small thing you have to do that clear okay that is a small small thing you have to do right next uh, come to our normal yes still some more things i have to explain sir here i'm using edit plus i'm using notepad plus plus okay notepad notepad plus plus we can use or otherwise or otherwise python shell i can use Python, Python, shell only we can use. All these things are just a normal editors. Are you getting just normal editor? Okay, some support you can expect about syntax highlighting, syntax highlations. Next time after that, indentation, some support you people can able to expect definitely from here. Okay, like, uh, but make, make sure, sir. Okay, if you want to develop big, big applications in the Python, Highly recommended compulsory we should go for IDE's concept. Are you getting? Highly recommended compulsory we should go for which concepts are IDE. IDE's concept mandatory, right? Okay. Then, sir, what are various IDE? What is that IDE, sir? It is not IDE. It is not IDE. Observe that IDE. Integrated development environment. Sir. There, the code by default will be will be will be generated automatically. 
answer 70 percent of the code automatically will be generated by the ide only next everywhere auto suggestions are there sir if you are using which methods are available next and after that auto completion by default will be there auto completion commands auto suggestions like uh, so for the python what is the best ide pi charm remember that sir what is the what is the best idea is on pi charm okay next uh, universal idea for any, any language even we can use eclipse also are you getting next one after that spider sp ir sp why i'm not sure sir spider okay S P Y D E R. okay spider is also one 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 ide for the python sir okay make make sure here the code will become very very easy okay most of the code by default will be generated automatically we are not required to do that sir okay like sir just observe if i open the google if i open the google just i'm using python uh, most popular idea yes okay you can use most popular <coughs> idea yes okay like you can then automatically you can yes have you observed right spider uh, eric uh, next up uh, jump like are you getting ideal we already we saw this one sir okay wing id autumn next uh, like uh, multiple things are available but among all these things highly recommended which one is PyCharm? Okay, maybe uh, PyCharm, PyCharm. Definitely, I will discuss about this concept. Don't worry about that, sir. PyCharm, like clear. Okay, but anyway, so my sincere suggestion until completing your core Python, core Python and the advanced Python, core Python and the advanced Python, advanced Python, at least until your database concepts completed before starting your frameworks, highly recommended. Don't go for any IDE. Why is the reason here? Yeah? If the IDE is always going to provide support, if the IDE is always going to generate some code, the chance of learning by default will become very, very less. Remember that, okay? For learning point of view, use the normal editors, but while real-time coding point of view, compulsory you require to use IDE's concept, okay? So after completing our core Python, advanced Python, at least slowly you have to work on IDE's concept. But while learning, don't touch bloody these things. <laughs> because if, sir, sir, if suppose assume that assume that so if best if someone is there with you who is going to provide support like anything everything is going to provide everything is going to provide okay like uh, if someone is there to support for you then automatically some way it is the advantage some way it is the disadvantage also suppose someday that person is not there <laughs> someday that person is not there then automatically our life by default will become very horrible man now these days we know if i can use uh, array 19 into 19 can you please tell what about its value array 19 19 19 19 what about its value if i can ask this question most of the people are going to open calculator and start calculating <laughs> are you getting open calculator and start uh, sir doing and telling the reason sir because the people forgot already using the using the memory remember that our mind uh, the people forgot the same kind of problem is there with uh, these ideas but in real time compulsory we require to use ide's concept only no one is allowed to use this edit plus and so on the reason for that is sir fast development speed speed development must be required okay their deadlines and so on next step, that's why debugging all those big big supports are there from the ide yes that's why you should have clarity about this ide is also clear okay next uh, some people may use uh, jupyter notebook okay jupyter jupyter notebooks are there like a uh, jupyter notebooks like some some people may use not required if it is really the people who require i want a separate session on that also okay don't worry that's all yeah yeah anaconda pythons jupyter notebook okay that's all sir this is about from my side i hope you people are in a position yeah yeah we will discuss in the regular sessions which time so i hope you people are able to understand how to install okay python in our system in how many ways we can able to run our python program clear for all of you up to that sir in my regular classes whatever i'm doing whatever i'm doing uh, every day now you are in a position to do that now tomorrow onwards i won't see in my regular classes sir I won't, uh, in my regular classes, I won't, sir, I don't know how to install Python, how to run, sir, you are executing from the command prompt, what you are doing, such a type of things, don't ask any doubt, because these are the things, right, okay, that's all. 
Next uh, one question: Can we develop GUI applications by using Python? Yes, yes, Srinivas Reddy. GUI applications we can able to develop. The corresponding modules are available, man. Uh, so Python having GUI, GUI applications, network applications, database application, every type of applications we can able to develop by using Python. Don't worry about that. GUI concept also there, just like in Java, AWT, Sphinx concept are there. Something like you can you have here also, right? Next time, uh, Python don't have compiler. Yes, yes, Avinasha. Python is the interpreted language. Whenever you are asking Python interpreter to run, first Python virtual machine is going to do compilation. First Python virtual machine is going to do compilation. Syntax checking it is going to do that first. If for anywhere syntactical mistakes are there, immediately will get syntax error. Are getting if anywhere syntax mistake is there, immediately you will get syntax error. Once you corrected that syntax error, then only, then only uh, it is going to run. Then only it is going to start execution. Remember that. So Python virtual machine having inbuilt capability of compilation. Being a programmer, we are not required to compile explicitly. Are getting but in Java, we have to compile and then we have to run. Are getting Java, we have to compile and we have to run. But in Python, we are not required to do that, sir. Clear? Yes, Avinash. Are you able to understand? Okay, that's all. Next up. If some project developed in Python 2 and how to manage them after 2020, Srivani, it is going to be Python will be there, but so language level enhancements, language level support you can't expect. But your Python program happily, it is going to run no problem at all after 2020 also. But if, if you want uh, some updated features, some updated features, then such a type of updation, language level updations won't be there. Whatever the things are there up to that only you have to use. Suppose you are using some mobile, some mobile. Sir, currently I'm feeling very comfortable with that mobile. If you want to use that mobile lifetime, no problem at all. So tomorrow I want that feature, this feature, no. Because the manufacturer telling this is the final version. Best examples are the people who are coming from Java. The people who are coming from Java. Okay. So struts, struts 1.x, struts 2.x, web framework. Have you remembered anyone? Yes, ma'am. Uh, have you remembered anyone? Struct. Struts framework, okay. Almost do you know the day is gone. Now the people are forgot to use because the people are telling that the people, the people are telling that okay, sir, lifetime we are not going to update. This is the lifetime version. Then slowly the people are moving somewhere else because every day I want new features, new features, and so on. That's why compulsory we should go for newer thing. That's why Python 3 is the recommended. So now everyone is using Spring framework. Okay, that's all, sir, from my side. So that in the next uh, somewhere we are going to discuss. We are we are going to discuss about uh, yes uh, how to use Jupyter notebook, how you can able to execute Python program by using PyCharm, Eclipse, and Spider. These kind of ideas also I will take care. Just let me stop the recording and then I will clarify your doubts.